we are all loaded up in the kayak. Got a barrel, got my dry bag. Quick nosy around the corner here. Pull up on a rock that looks pretty good. I've been told to go give it a go. And go land base that. So let's go check it out. And if I like it, I'll grab some stuff and stay for the night. So there's a bit of swell still. Hopefully it doesn't wrap around behind too much because I've got to get all this off. And I might be like, nah, that's not happening. Look at that. This is awesome. I'm gonna drag up here somewhere. One thing off. Woo! She's a bit wet. Wow, okay. Anyway, they can go up there. I can go up there. Slightly more hectic than I anticipated. Um, just steep and nasty rocks. So anyway, we got the kayak up, got my gear spread out here. We're gonna hike to the point of this rock and go fish from there. Mm. I got a little bit of burly in the water out there. Don't have much though. Let's go start casting. We're gonna take the light set up. Sorry, sun's behind me. We're going to take the light set up with 30 pound Tazline and a placky on there. And we're also going to take the heavy set up with a popper. Full specs of all the fishing gear I'm using is in the video description, by the way. If you're interested, let's try out here. And then I'm gonna work back in towards the wash. He's interested.
fish on. Mm, little snap. All right, bugger, I'm putting a hook on and a bit of bait. I didn't bring proper hooks with me, but I just took one off of one of the stick baits I brought. So I'll tie this on and we will drop it in and see what happens. Squid head going in, see if we can catch something. Fish on! It swallowed it. I didn't even know it swallowed it. Go. Decent sized snapper right there. We're gonna throw this one back. If we keep any, it'll be later on tonight. Maybe the guys on the kayak can keep something for dinner instead. Yep, straight away. Sweet! Let's get another. I might fish from here now. That was hard work to get that over here. Oh, yep, something's hit it. I saw that swim out and grab it. Swim out, swim out. I feel the weed on my line. Is this a bigger fish or just the same? No, not even. Probably a smaller fish. Beautiful looking fish. Man, they got some fight on them. <clears throat> Another snapper. They're pulling out this orange stuff. That is not its swim bladder. But, um, solid little fish. I'm gonna go throw it back. Yeah, three does. That little fish nearly did me over in the kelp there, so I'm just gonna try get a slightly better angle see if we can get one out here there's a little one is he on he's on this is a little one Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Biggest bait, smallest snapper. Oh well. Tiny. Oh, right, let's see how this goes. Throwing a light plaque out here. The fish have been darting out and smashing it, so I'm hopeful. But they might come out and smash this. Yep, on. There we go. So I'm to figure it out. Either the fish have come on the bite because of the food, because of the bait. It's only a little snap again, but. Tiny little thing. Where are the big ones? 
thought they were meant to be big snapper here. They're all hiding. Anyway, we'll chuck this one back. First land base snap on a plaque. Tiny schizo little thing. All right, I'm packing up. I'm gonna go find somewhere else to fish. Hopefully I'll camp there for the night. That's the plan. There is a boat, main boat around the corner in a cove, which is the boat that we're all staying on. But um, I'm gonna probably go do my own thing tonight. Go, go for an explore, check out the place. We're just gonna have a quick try in here. I can't not. We've got the backpack on. Got everything ready, about to leave. Well, let's try this quickly. Probably end up with the fish of the trip in here. Ah, uh, who knows. I want to jump in the water, but I've had an ear infection on this, at the start of this trip, and I picked up antibiotics along the way, because it was just screwing me over. But, um, we'll see, maybe, maybe in a few more days. I don't want to push it. Do not want another ear infection. Just the flights messed with my head. Unfortunately, I've flown a few times before, but that one did not agree with me. Oh yeah. Fire out, it's surging here. This one, ah oh, crap. Oh, yeah. That was a bit, how's it going? I was actually fishing that rock just over that way earlier. Um, I went back to the main boat and chatted to them and realized that the wind is probably not so good for where I wanted to go but this spot looks amazing some different rocks in here and I got one of the guys caught a big kingfish so I don't think you can see it they filleted it I have the frame with me and I'm gonna I'm leaving a nice burly trail in the water but I'm gonna tie it off to the rocks and get a burly trail pump and see what comes in How's that? Huge imposing cliff, almost hanging over me. As long as nothing falls on me, I'm all right. I don't like the thought though. Oh, let's just go. We're gonna go up on this one in here. Maybe in this next wave and then we go. Hold it.
Holy moly, this one's a bit of a wave. <clears throat> so I'm up on the rock now. Kayak is there, poor thing. Got a few scratches on it. Fishing gear here. I've thrown the kingfish frame in the water on a rope which Steve caught out of the kayak around the other side of the island. And uh, we're going to wait for it to do its thing and see if it brings anything in. And I'm going to lop a plastic in here, I'll show you. Just want to throw a plastic in here because I feel like this would never get fished. It is crazy looking. And I can't imagine many people ever bothering to fish it. So you never know what could be in here. And I need to catch dinner. I got no fish for dinner tonight. And that is all that there is for dinner tonight. Just fish, whatever I catch. What's going on here? Is my leader not all right? Oh yeah. Oh. Had a hit. What'll it do? Yep, there's fish in there. Lurking. Most of my fish earlier today came on bait. So it might end up being bait. I do have a little bit of bait it brought out. Here. Let's see. Ten bites. I don't want to strike. I want it to take it because there's no skin on the bait. <clears throat> Little fish. Well, I won't go hungry. I'll let this one go. But um, that was pretty easy. So. Oh, will I let it go? I used a circle hook and he scoffed it. I can't even see that. So, nice little snapper there. I was not planning on eating one this small for dinner, although it's probably the best size, really. But this guy, and also I was probably going to try catch dinner later, but he swallowed the hook too fast, so we're going to keep him. Put him out of his misery. I don't know how far over. I can't see into the water properly, so let's just go there. We'll stay up here. Hopefully I don't get buried by a big one. Another little one. Hopefully this one's... Oh, what is it? Is it a snapper? Yeah, it is, yes. I thought it wasn't for a sec. Hopefully it's pinned in the corner. That's why I'm using a circle hook. Yes, looks like it did its job. Well, or you can catch snapper. They're not very big at the moment. 
I'm sure there's some big ones lurking. Well, if I hook up a big one here, I sure am going to have fun trying to land it. See what happens. That's a better fish, eh? Not much better. That's cool. Certainly there's no shortage of these things. Mate, you lop a bait in anywhere. Oh, look at the size of some of those ones. Wait, 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 wait. Let's have a look. Any of them big? Oh, that one's a good one. Look at that. That's incredible. It stole the bait. So that's a bigger fish just here behind him. Much bigger fish. Another beautiful snapper. There was a bigger one following him in. Gonna let him go because I have one for dinner already, and there's so many snapper here. It's crazy. How far out? Is there going to be one under here? Oh, I think, did that just get eaten? It just disappeared. It did too. Is a good sized fish. There's a few fish in here. Quite a few. Oh, they're all just living under this. Oh. Mate, he's a hard fighter. few other fish coming out. Literally, the snapper are almost the pest that you can't get past. It's crazy. There's so many here. And I'm sure if I had a good proper burly trail, I would have them on it, but I haven't. I should have brought out something decent for it. I need to catch a bunch of car wire and burly them, but I haven't seen, I haven't even seen a car wire yet. Solid fish. Another one. So many, so many of these things. Um, I'm just going to fill up my dinner now, which is the snapper I caught earlier. Nice pan sized one. Eat the fish. Well, I just filleted the fish and uh, it started raining. So I'm going to quickly deal with all my stuff and then we'll cook dinner somewhere, I think. Hopefully it holds off, but it's just going all over cast and a light drizzle. I'm just going to move some of my stuff back to where I'm going to camp for the night. Wouldn't be New Zealand without a bit of rain anyway, would it now? 
So current situation is in a cave and it's pouring down with rain. A very small little cave. But um, I'm gonna cook up some dinner in here and hopefully it backs off. And if it doesn't back off, it'll probably be an early night. World's biggest fry pan that I picked up at the shops the other day. World's most simple cooked fish coming up, but simple is good. Number one. Oh yeah, that is so good. We have a feed of snapper I caught just a few hours ago, a bit of QP. It's just on my knife roll and we've literally got fillets under the other side here ready to cook. And it stopped raining. It's bloody beautiful out here actually. At least this should be very quick and easy. Throw that out. That's why I like the bivy. Uh, especially when it's not raining, it's better. But when it's raining, it does the job. Let's go that there, that there. I'm just finishing off my last bit of food while I watch. And now I'm gonna go cast at the end. Oh, look at them. They're out here now. Just cruising, I just saw one. Oh, look at him. Oh, he's circling. Am I about to get screwed over? There's some good sized fish in there. Could be the best one yet. I don't think it's a monster, but oh. Nice size fish. Are you going to be strong enough? Um, line, 60 pound and a hook should be. Still nothing massive, but looks sick in the wide angle lens, so. All right, we're going to release anyway. Good morning. That's where I slept last night. Had a bit of rain on and off. Um, it did clear up and I tried to get star time lapse and then I started raining and I had to jump out and rescue my camera. Let's, um, we'll head out there and go for a fish. Uh, I just watched a snapper cruise through that was big enough that got me excited to get the heavy outfit out because I'm pretty sure I'd get smoked on the light outfit. I just don't know where he's going now. I had to quickly tie a hook on. But, oh, is that him? That's a big one. Yeah, that's a good sized one. That could be him there. Watch this. Oh, he's skittish. Well, I haven't, I haven't seen that big snapper come back again. But um, 
I'm just going to lop this out on the heavy outfit out the back and see if it comes through. I can watch this as well. I think it's just a lot more skittish. They don't get big being stupid, do they? Finally, howdy. How's that little boat, eh? I saw a big one cruise in here this morning, but he looked at my boat and took off. He's something he didn't like. Yeah, they they don't get a uh, big by being stupid, do they? Cheers. Beautiful snapper. Back it goes. Whew, windy. Uh, I'm done for the morning. Only caught one snapper. Didn't see the big one come back. So I'm going to pack everything up, chuck it on the kayak, and Paddle out of here. Thanks for watching everyone. We'll see you on the next one.